Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Divinity Original Sin 2. This is Colonel RPG and Bumpy Max Weekends as usual. And my usual today was going to go a little bit on the oiliest direction for some reason. I don't know why, don't ask me. I'm That's crazy. Fine. What are you doing? Opening the, the barrier that was blocking us from getting out. There's a statue back here. I know. I'm going to talk to the statue. Go ahead. The day this head and hands are missing, severed as if by a sword. You can't tell if this was meant to be the symbolic somehow or mere an act of vandalism. Uh, well, there's something strange about the statue. Let me like it, look it over with great care with my wits. As you take in its chiseled details, you have a vision. The statue comes to life and embraces you awkwardly with its broken arms. Unable oh. to resist, you're flown away into an endless dark. Oh boy. I am. Oh do. Oh, okay. That shrine seems to have brought me here, says my guy. The deity's head and okay. hands uh, are Seeing its spirits. Did you see spirits before? I'm in the Hall of Echoes, too. Did you get teleported here as well? I, yeah, I used it. Should I? Oh, You're in spirits. a completely different area. A higher power has similarly granted you the ability to see spirits. As you learn to channel more source, you may one day be able to use this powerful ability at will within the mortal realm. Cool. So we're still getting oh, tutorial stuff. Are you down there? Uh... No. I, no, yeah, I am. You see me in the map, but down there is not really the. Oh, okay. The thing. There's also, a uh, lady over there. Columnar jointing for the wind, because this always happens. Excuse me. There's only like seven. You don't know what the. You don't know the name of this sort of geological formation that we see here. I don't know. There's only, only like seven or eight places on Earth that even have this, and like it's very rare that they look like this. It's columnar jointing, okay. and. Uh, it appears a lot. Very strange. Wow, so a lot I can of talk to a Madia. And you have a Madia's down there. So, no, wait a minute. A Madia? I, I can only talk Tur to my Sendelius. goddess Zor Zoral Stissa. I'll let you go first. Oh, okay, I can, I can listen in on the conversation. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. oh, you want me to go first? Okay. Yeah, you go ahead. I'll listen. You just need to click. Yeah, okay. Excuse me, miss. Uh, you kind of didn't like me too much before. I actually can't. Oh, wait. Now I can. You walk towards the figure on the dais, but wisps of mist start to cloud, cloud your vision. With each step, the mist gets thicker, hiding the figure from sight. You see a shape through the fog. Reaching out, you touch the figure. It turns, and you see your mother. Mommy! What? She smiles warmly, laying her no. hand on yours. My child, she whispers. My child. Creepy. <laughs> Really? <laughs> Crasp into the lump in your non-existent throat. Uh, I'm I'm more concerned with is 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 this? Am I seeing my mother or am I seeing a Madia who is my mother? I don't know. I'm gonna yeah stare at the woman before you. you can barely even remember her face. She steps towards you, cradling your skull in her claws. <laughs> it doesn't matter, my child. She whispers. Nothing matters now that we're together. Your skull is filled with a sense of home, the sounds of a babbling brook, the feeling of a youth spent playing in the fields. You shake your head, your mind stumbling. Your childhood was nothing like that. Whoa. Hush, child, your mother whispers, her scaled hand squeezing yours. It's okay. You're home now. Home with me. <laughs> um, I'm going to take your hand and examine it closely. I, I don't know what's going you on. You try to grip her hand. But your own passes straight through it. There's great fire going down. I know. Going down. They're fighting something. It's weird. You look up into her eyes, but she's already disappearing, melting away like fog in the morning sun. Soon, there's nothing left. Well, that thing well, only that's has 22,323 hit points. I think that's going to be okay. You're left standing on the cold, glowing cobbles. As the mist clears, you see a new figure before you, a figure you know well from temples. Before you stands the goddess Amadia. Cool. Uh, what was that? Unpleasant, but necessary. <laughs> Wait. Oh, she doesn't look like the mother I saw before. Please forgive my little deception, Can you... but I feared you might not be quite what you seemed. These are dangerous times. Can you hear her? Uh-huh. Yep. Okay. Yep. The void creeps ever closer, my child. Even here... Even in the Hall of Echoes, I cannot be sure I am safe. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not your child. You kind of made that very clear. Are you not? I am Amadia, 
mother of magic. And what are you, sweet one, if not magic? Well, that's true. Well, you know. No, I am more your mother than some creature of flesh ever was. I agree. And you are my child. We are both of the other. Bound together when the void would see us torn apart. Creepy. Um. Yeah, the seven keep the void at bay, or they should anyway. Should You should be fighting it, not talking to me. Once this was true, but alas, now... She turns and gestures to the scene behind her. Uh -huh. Down below, you can see the six other gods fighting, clawing at each other, everyone oh. desperately trying to get the upper hand. Uh, it all suddenly makes sense in my head. <laughs> you, the look, you look on a horror, so we can't fight amongst themselves. Ask yeah, I'm going to say that. Have they been corrupted think, by the void? I think my character is, uh, is very, very devoted about what the order of gods and all that. Let's go with that. No, uh, the seven, the seven can fight among themselves. Indeed not, but they have been corrupted by their own vanity, by the pettiness of the mortals they crafted. For the void has spread everywhere, from empires to hamlets, from kings to peasants, it corrupts all things. I had hoped they would be spared from its ravages, but alas, the other six were too close to their creations. I fear it is too late for them, for us. But you, my child, you are as removed from the other races as I. Huh. You are pure. You can be my champion. Yeah, no. It's because I'm undead. Her champion asks I... her what she wants to do. You're not going to reject the call of a goddess. You'll do whatever you can to help her. And say that you didn't yeah. call out of that tomb to become a lackey. I'm going to go with the th second one. I'm not going to reject the call of a goddess. I stood up for what was right, and I would ask no more of you. I will guide you, but first you must return to the world and escape these swamps. Although you will not return unchanged. Oh. As your first oh. step towards righting the wrongs of this world, I grant you my blessing. Interesting. Amadia stretches out her hand, and you feel a warm glow spread through your bones. You feel not whole, but closer to it, as if a new corner of your spirit has been unlocked. Interesting. Eh. I, I, I gained the ability to bless the ground. You know you know the blessed ground that we see before? Uh -huh. cool. But that also clears cursed. You might gain the same thing, but I don't know what your story is going to be. Uh, I'm not going to end this dialogue before you do your own, but let's just continue. You may have noticed I have tried to help you on your journey. That I can bless the very water beneath you. Oh, it's her voice, okay. Now oh, makes sense. you have that power for yourself. Nice. And this is only the beginning. I want that power. More and greater powers await you. If only you will seek them. And seek them you must. But it's before you begin, you know a word of warning. <laughs> I gather that you travel with a path of others. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, you have found- I have found companions. It is only natural. Undeath can feel rather lonesome. See, but it's because I'm undead. be wary. Some of these creatures are more dangerous than they seem. <laughs> well, <laughs> Los is pretty- yeah, and Fane as well, I know. They are Godwoken, the chosen champions of the other six gods. Yes, I am. Wait a minute, and I'm not. Of course not. You're Fane. You're my. Or you're not Fane. You're Odessa. You're my little servant. No, but the, the Fane is God woken as well, nope. and Los is God woken as well. No, nope, they just think they are. Okay, let's see what happens. And then there is the one you know as Losa. Oh, she is Losa. Something else. She is She's... something yeah. wicked. You must beware of her above all others. Yeah, I knew that. She was she's nasty. For they will all walk the, the same, same path, path as you, but they cannot be allowed to reach its end. What? You must be the one. Only one of our people can wield this it's power. It's going to be me. Only you. Nope, me. No, you're we're going to cross this bridge when we get to it. She lays her hand on your skull and you see it clearly. <laughs> the others, the skull. gods, Amadia and <laughs> you. You are her chosen. 
You are her god -woken. Oh, so I'm god -woken as well. Okay, yeah, it makes no, sense. Not even so sorry. go forth into the world She's with my blessing, She's lying to you. You can't one. handle the divine. Heed my words and go. Okay, so you can uh, stop listening in. What I am going to do uh, is I'm going to listen to your conversation when you have your conversation with your god. I'm not going to be able to listen to the first line, but the, the, the reason I'm not ending it right now world, is because if I end, I probably will leave you. this place. And if I do, I probably won't be able to hear uh -huh. your god talk to you. Amid the soundless air of this alien world, a phantom-like figure awaits you. Or amid, sorry. Mm -hmm. She too is a lizard, as you can tell. But there are telltale details in her features that conjure memories of incense and mantras. Are you able to listen? I Not am for right now. I'll, okay. I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll let you know. The onyx eyes, three-layered crown, and feathered shoulders you recognize her from the statues that stand tall in desert sands. She is the goddess Zol Stissa, greatest of the Zol... seven. See, mine's the greatest. The greatest? Yeah. yeah. Get wrecked. She's Red taller. Prince, oh, I can't hear her. Be. May your words command the rivers. May your hands direct the winds. Fire of sun and rock of earth. May they serve you like faithful slaves. Red Prince. It is an honor. I can hear her now. For to whatever surprise, reason. the goddess sinks to her knees and bows before you in reverence. Uh, thank you. What? Thank you. Man, Better stand. You're... The prayer is hers, not yours. You've chanted it often. Uh, curtsy? Why would I curtsy? I'm a man lizard. I'm not a woman lizard. I don't curtsy and say the what? honor is yours. You can curtsy as a man. That's no. not a thing. You're right. It's not a thing. Tell her you are thirsty. An offering <laughs> of wine would be looked upon with favor. No. I'll better stand. Then you have prayed in vain. Oh, well that's that's not good. She rises and considers you with deep set admiration, like one would a work of art. Red Prince. God child. It's a god child. Truest ruby of all realms. Yes. Tell me. Do you know why you are red? So you are the spouse of the sun. That sounds painful and satisfying. Say it proudly. Remark that maybe you're of demon lineage, that it is what you were accused of after all. Answer her that you truly have no idea. Scoff and say you're most likely nothing but an aberration. It wasn't, didn't it say that something about the sun and that being your lineage for know. the empire? I'm going to be the spouse of the sun though, so. Yeah, I think so. Bam! Yes! The tale of your birth and the love borne to you by the sun will always remain a part of your mythology. But mm. I think there is another reason for your brightness. Because I'm awesome. You are I'm right. Red, red Prince. I'm red. red because prince. all of you is heart. I'm just one giant beating heart. Look at that. See? You doubted me, mm -hmm. fool. I never did. You are carnage. Except, please. And you are Concord. The Lord of War and Lord of Wisdom. You are lust. And you are love. Whatever. You are passion personified. I am passion personified. Thank you. That is why I saved you from the all-consuming sea. I don't... Why I soothed your lungs with my breath and placed you gently on the nearest shore. Problems, Odasto? Hmm? Yeah, I don't... I don't know. I mean, on... The, it, it it works well with your character, but I don't know if it works well with Red, the actual Red Princess character by the game. Sure. Hmm. Sure it does. I'm amazing. Continuing on. Red Prince... See? You I'm literally greater, greater than, than all, all the others. For you are the sum of all others. You are the Ur Father. The Ur Father. The well, life what? shaper made manifest in a man. The Uber I would Lizard. See that man, a god. I would agree with you. My I don't know what she wants baby. from you. She wants me to be this a god. Of she, this is out of character. This is out of character. No. But I think she might not have your best interest at the oh, heart. But this is out of character. She is the greatest <laughs> of the gods, and she wants me to join. And become the she's, true greatest of the gods. She's praising you up, up higher than herself. Because she knows. I'm the Red Prince. Mm -hmm. No, so I that is not possible. She is the god here, not you. Ask her if that is the reason she bowed before you. From that you see it as well. If divinity can be yours, then by all means you'll take it. Mm -hmm. And take it you must. For I am a goddess no longer. Oh. Robbed of my powers by the usurping divine. Mm -hmm. We, the Seven are gathered here in these horrid halls of echoes. Dead spirits vying for rebirth. 
Oh. But none of us will be the one. One of our children instead. A god woken like you. I have chosen you. Thank you. You are to be my champion. I say it seems strange to you. Why one? Why not seven? Just like there were. That is interesting. Say that you were always fond of her and took pleasure in her worship. You'd rather restore her godhood than... Nope. Tell her that you are ready. If you are the chosen champion, you will serve her. What must you do? I'm curious. I, can I... What's that? Can I just say, uh... This... Uh, watching your dialogue is just adding more and more context to my own dialogue with a, with a, uh, whatever her lady was. Um, Amadia. And I think... Amadia, yeah. I think her mission for me might very much go up against you. Yeah, there's I don't know only be one happen. one who ri rises to divinity and it's not going to be you, Odasto. You serve me. All right, say, but say I'm it not strange to you. I think my mission is to impede everyone from rising to divinity. No. Those days are over. Only one can don his head with stars and wield the sources of infinity. I like it. A great battle is being waged. It is the twilight of the Seven, and the day to dawn of the One. The powers of all divinity must unite. Yes, they and must. And they must unite in you, the, the paragon, paragon of, of lizards. lizards. I like that. <laughs> Our yes. kind must rule this world, and none other. None of the primordial slime that made it onto two oh. legs by nature's oversight. I love the disdain dripping from her words. That's it's that, so good. She's amazing. That's actually, that's very common to the lizards of this game. She's awesome. I like it. Take up the mantle, Red Prince, and all will be well. Oh, I plan to. All will be well. Indeed it will. As she speaks these last four words, the outline of the goddess shimmers, shakes, then transfigures into an all too familiar shape. Uh-oh. She stands before you in the guise of her, the woman you've been dreaming of uh -huh. for as long as you can remember. Oh. She's unparalleled beauty, and her skin's as red as yours. Yeah, hey, you didn't get to see her. She's the one that I uh, had my coiled sleep with. Uh, yeah, I, I can saw on the other side. I can see her now. Yep. So that's why you're yes. passionate. Here she stands, your Indeed. deepest secret, your deepest desire. She whom you've longed for since your soul slipped into consciousness. And you lock eyes with her. Look at her, savor the moment, let your heart reach for her. Ask the goddess who she is. Who is this woman you've been seeing in your dreams? Say she's not the first to play this game. A dreamer showed her to you as well. Mm. Ask her. You think her but a mirage, ephemeral as smoke. But you know better, don't you? Know with all your soul. I could drop a stone into the well of your heart. And it would take the span of a son's life for the little traveler to hit bottom. Such is the depth of your devotion. I am pretty devoted. It is a good thing for the life shaper to possess such affection. Oh, for she too, shaper. your secret love, has her part to play in downfall and divinity. The new D&D &D game brought to you by Mattel. No, I'm kidding. All right. What? Downfall <laughs> and divinity, D&D. &D. Oh, I... I did. Uh, oh, yeah. I just got too it. Too quick for you. Too That's fine. Yes. <laughs> now of divinity, let me give you a taste. Ooh, yes. She steps close, puts her hand on your chest, and leans in. Okay. Kiss me, my Ooh. prince, for I am her. Uh... Kiss me, for I am your one true love. Oh, boy. Now, well, here's where it gets tricky. Why? Do I? Why wouldn't you? Because I don't think she's really it. She's yeah, but showing you're, her. Oh. You're accepting a, the goddess. Yeah, yeah. The kiss is long and sweet as rose. Hey, wood. plus skill. As it endures, you can feel a whole new power invade and expand your spirit. Cool. Cleanse me of the cursed status. I like it. Understood. I think she would explain herself if you had refused. Yeah. Most likely. Hopefully. There. Or now I've been untrue to my one faithful love. It is all Stissa who is withdrawn oh, from you what is in her that? own godly guise. Oh, once more. What is that? She's not shimmery anymore. It's just her. I think you might have. What? S say you will remember this kiss. Tell her her magic is uncanny. She even tasted the same as she of dreams. Ask what she just did to you. What are you going to say? Mm, I don't know. 
Huh. Play the second one. I, I was her, just like I said. Oh. But the blessing I gave you, that was all me. So confusing. It's fine. Cherish this purest of pearls I have given you. A droplet of untainted source and a promise of things to come. Creepy. I bless the very water beneath your feet. Sweet. Now you may wield that power for yourself. So take it with you back to our beautiful world. There, use it to make that world yours. I have a thousand questions first. Of course you have, but they can wait. Aww. What is life without a little mystery? You mean video games? What is Before video games? I let you go, no. though, so bring there the fourth is one wall. more matter we must touch upon. <laughs> you are traveling with company, yes? Yeah, oh. I made some unlikely friends. No, not friends. Yes, I, I know, I know. My I boy, am your, I am arrival. your servant. I am your servant. Yes, you are. Too, and may be courted by the lesser six. Lesser six. But you will be a god, none other. Smile at your fellow wanderers, but ready your knife. It's an axe. For its time will come. Oh, and Losa, lovely Aww. little Losa. Why does everybody want to kill her? Just kill her now and be done with it. No, I'm not going to kill Losa. So, now we must part with fire in your soul and resolve in your mind. I'm actually really worried about Losa now. <laughs> really I, <yeah>. worried. <laughs> That's two people who said the same thing. Nobody mentioned Fane. Both people no, said to get rid of Losa. Fane is cool. Losa is not. But Losa, can we play as Losa? Yeah, she's one of the, the characters you can choose from the beginning. That might be very interesting to play as a background, but let's let's move on. We'll meet again, Red Prince. Always will I walk beside you. Thank you. The goddess steps back and waves, the warmth of her lips still lingering on yours. Then, sudden light and lightning, and you are gone. Did you manage to get a kiss from a goddess? Nope. Didn't think so. Got my skull embraced. Yeah, you got your, your skull grabbed. It's not the same. Though you did get your arm bone licked, which is disgusting and weird. No, but that was another... I know, that was... Was that, yeah. was that Losa? That might have been no, Losa. No, there was the... Oh, that no, no, that Losa. was the other one that wanted to kill the guy that was going to drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm ending mine. Do we want to try Fane and... Hey, Master. And... <laughs> you seem flushed. I... What, what happened? Nothing. Nothing? So, what, what's that on your li Why? What, what's so, going on? So how how uh, hey. how much do you want to <laughs> serve me? <laughs> Get away. I don't trust you. Losa, kill him. Anyway, do we want to go uh, through with Losa and Fane yeah, in the next does, episode? It doesn't work. I tried it. The deity's head and oh, hands I'm going to try missing. Fane. Seven. Okay. Yep, no, it doesn't. But it doesn't do. He doesn't do so it. So it's just our main character. So. Okay. It's uh, just, yeah. So... Interesting. Uh, bear in mind that none of our characters should know about the other one. So if we are not sharing, which I am not, and I don't think you would, uh, we, we don't know about each other's situation hey, here. Hey, I've, I've told you from the beginning that I'm God Woken and I'm going to become, I'm going to be the new divinity, so. I think, I think yes. I think you have, you you have said that. But my my but plans my are not just a, to return to my throne, but to return as a my God. Character, my character has assumed more of a blindly faithful uh, role let's in this he, role. Let's hope he stays that way. Yeah. No, blindly faithful to the gods, and to you as well, but my character doesn't... He doesn't want to... Um... What are you doing? I was trying to knock you down, but you stopped moving. That's oh. Um... I don't know what's going to happen. I'm curious. I'm curious to know. Alright. Think... So we did that. Let's... I guess we can go back now? What's over here in the... Uh... The historian. Why is there a flaming historian over here? Because all the historians are flaming. What? What? What historian are you talking about? Uh, it's over to. Let's see. Can I ping on the map? Yes, you can. There's oh. a historian up there. He's on fire. He's the guy for the pigs. Uh, I mean, he must be. Probably. Anyway, we're gonna what? Teleport back to uh, the Amadia it's Sanctuary. Call. Yeah. Yep. Go, I'm let's teleporting. Go. And in the and don't forget to get out of it before you get melted. And in the next yeah. episode, we'll continue with our adventures. We have the purging wand now, which oh, you yeah. still have, right? I do, I do. Okay, so we have the purging wand, mm -hmm. which I don't see. Where is it? Uh, it's probably equipped. Let me see if it is. Oh, it's on a. So. Uh... Oh, it's on Odesto. Oh, yeah, it's, it's the equipped. Wand of nature, really? Was oh, it that's good? why I have purge. 
Oh, you goofball. You thought you got a new thing. <laughs> so Odasto yeah. has it. Is it actually a good weapon? It's uh, It works as a, the drained one that we saw before. It is a fire, so it just focuses on fire a little bit more. I think that's better. I don't know. I think having a, a split is better, personally, because you already light them on fire. They're burning from it. And then if yeah, they're resistant, well, you can always change it, though, right? I can always change it. Yeah, I I, I'm keeping the, uh, the other one, which is exactly the same, except yeah. it's air instead of fire. It's I can kind of a, a mess situation. All right, in the next episode, yep. we'll talk to Gratiana because she we have her soul jar, which is interesting. Interesting, yeah. And then also we got to figure out what we need to do with the purging wand and all that stuff to go deal with the Shrieker. So, is, mm. is there anything else? I think it's your turn to, to end us, friend. If it is my turn, then, well, it's time to say goodbye. I'm Colonel RPG. He's oh Bumpy Book Sweekums. We're all God Woken, but we don't know that. Well, actually, we do know that we're God Woken because the gods told us. But, uh, yeah, for right now, that's that, and we'll see you next episode. <laughs> all right, bye. Bye.